Hey everyone, this is Ravi Singh with Tricky English Express. I am excited for another lesson today. We will be learning how to think in English. It's so Basically, learning to think in English is huge step towards fluency. Really, I am so happy that you joined me today for this important lesson. But before we get started, I want to remind you that if you have like to get all of your latest videos right when they come out, feel free to subscribe below. Okay. Today we are going to think in English to improve your English speaking skills. So let's get started. I have got some tips for you today. My first tips for learning to think in English is to get comfortable thinking to yourself in English. So for many people talking to themselves. I hope you are paying more attention to the relation that then so I have few tips for those of you who don't usually talk to yourself in English. If you do talk to yourself in English, feel free to share some tips below in um, the comments. So my tips, first tips learning and to talk to yourself in English is so start to very simple. Begin by talking to yourself when you start any work about it too and think about yourself and your object in your room. So the key here is that for one minute you continuously talk, just use the words you already know this will really you with your fluency and the next time you see that the object you will automatically begin to think in english so i suggest you do this three times a day for a minute okay let's move on and um, my next tips for how to think in english you care about fluency so that's why it's time that is so helpful and because you will be learn so many words Okay, let's move on to my next tip for thinking in English. This tip is when you are in a conversation and you don't know the words instead of the stopping and that's what fluency is not perfection. It's a being able to flow to be fluid in your conversation. So the next time you are talking with someone and you forget a word, just describe the word instead. So I have a little challenge for you right now. Keep a diary and write something on that about it. Okay, let's move on my next tips. Last tip is to create a mantra in English. A mantra is word or the phrase that the phrase that you can repeat to yourself that you will remind you in the something. So for example, I suggest creating a mantra in English that you can say right when you wake up in the morning before you speak in English native language, your first words can be in English. This will be amazing because it will automatically turn your brain onto the English. A good mantra for the meaning might be the something like you wake up and you say the to yourself every morning in English. I am amazing and excited about learning more English today. Very simple and very positive. It turns your brain on to English right away. I also suggest that you use a mantra at night, right before bed at the last you of the day can be in English like I am really proud of all of the English I learned today. I am excited to learn more English as I dream. I hope you enjoyed this lesson as much as I did. I think it's one of the most important lessons for uh, of it was really fun of share it with you. If you like this video, feel free to give us a like, to give us a comment, subscribe to this channel. Thank you guys so much. See you later. Thank you.